Texas. Okay, welcome to Wacom, Texas, the show where we dream past the part. And you screencast some art. I'm Chris Kerr. And I'm Jay Myers. So today you can see that we're doing things a little bit different. We have the magic hand cam. Uh, we're not showing our faces today because Chris was in a motorcycle accident. His Cannondale uh, ran off the road. Well, it's the season. You know, it's icy and slick outside. And um, yeah, I wasn't really paying attention. And I wiped out and I actually hurt my beautiful face. face so um, rather than show our faces, we're just going to show my hands and um now look at the technique too this you can learn a lot from just this kind of um accident it's a beautiful accident it ended up being a good thing your face might look better and yeah um get some reconstructive surgery going yeah okay so, so i saved a little time and i already drew um a hand which we'll show you in a minute when you can I actually show him right now do you want to pick up that yeah let's just take a look at what he's done already so he drew this hand here it's uh a a hand that looks like it's maybe perhaps going to pet, which is why we called this one hand pet because it's going to be the pet. Okay, and then I'm drawing a dog. And I'm actually drawing a dog from memory. I'm not looking at a dog. Um, I'm actually just doing it from memory. Um, oh, that's a cute dog with big eyes. Yeah, so a big puppy dog, eyes, a smile. So, but we're, I mean, you know, we're drawing a dog, but what we're really doing today is we're going to talk about hands because it's going to be all about hands. You see the hands on screen. You see that he drew a hand already. So it's just kind of a, uh, an episode about hands, which is neat. It's a fascinating thing that we all take advantage of, you know. Uh, we use them every day, and we don't really thank them. So take this time to maybe go ahead and say thank you, hands. Yeah. Uh, also, take time to moisturize your hands. Because, take care of them. Yeah, you want to take care of your hands. Uh, you know, the, the history of hands is quite unique. You know, it's an evolutionary thing that we were fortunate enough to... Yeah, when were, when were hands invented? Did you have to answer that? No. Okay. Uh, I, I don't know when they were invented, but I'm sure they evolved from, I guess, fish fins. So fish fins are kind of like the original hands. Uh, we've no, come a long I ways. Think, I think bird wings are the original hands. That's what mm, I heard. No, I don't think so. I think bird wings have evolved into, uh, I don't know, maybe... Nah, I, I think fins. I think we actually. Are I was testing you. I thought you believed in the creation theory. Oh, that's right. Yes. Well, I mean, true. We were we were given hands yeah. for hands. We didn't have you know fins I will be ever. Telling your mom what you just said. Well, please. You came from the. Okay. Well, please don't. Evolve from a fish. Okay. Well. Okay. Uh, not. I want to keep the focus on hands, but I also want to talk a little bit about dogs. Um, it's a cute dog. Yeah, most dogs have spots and freckles and. Um, so, and, and I like how this one you kind of left the imagination, let, left the second half of the dog to the imagination. We we can only think that maybe that dog's second half of its face looks like the, this half that we see, but you know maybe it was also hurt in a motorcycle accident. Yeah, maybe right. we're not showing that for right. a reason as well. Right. Well, also I wanted to point to the fact that that looks no, awesome, by the way. That looks no, great. no face is symmetrical. Actually, our left side of our face is different than our right side of our face, so. Um, that's why I thought I would um, just draw one side of the face for this dog. So my face is a lot like my own hands. They're not symmetrical, actually. Maybe just a little bit of saliva to make mm -hmm. it look more realistic, because most dogs do a lot of drooling. Mm -hmm. And I think I might actually do a neck, too. Oh. The hay. Yeah, but why not? Why not do a neck? Um, it's looking oddly human. Can I do one more color? Is there time? Yeah, we got time. Let's right. do another color. What pink? kind of color? Pink. Pink? Yep. Yeah, we're going to do a little bit of animation today, too, so we're going to hopefully um, hustle along here in a second, and we'll do some animation <laughs> yeah, in we'll Final Cut. Like usual, we're Final Cut 10 this time. Uh, we'll just do, be doing some keyframing. So you've got a cute dog here, and you've got a hand. You can only imagine what we're going to animate. This is going to be pretty fantastic. All right. And unlike humans, dogs do not have opposable thumbs. Right. I thought you were going to mention that. No, I know. That's where I was getting, but... You, but uh, yeah. All right. So. That is the dog. Cool. So let's save this image. Now we're going to do file. I don't know if you can see what I'm doing, but you're going to do file, save as. Now we've done this before, but it's been a little while, so let's go over it. We're going to save it as a JPEG, but just for the sake of finding this, I'm going to call it 1111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111111
and um, and do some really cool stuff. So uh, save on the desktop. Maximum quality. We don't. This doesn't really matter because it's just a outlined image. It's not like we're doing, you know, a photo or anything. And here we're timing out. Whoa, what the heck? Okay, well we're just. Hey, here's a little throwback to last year. Remember when I used to say, "Animate this." Yeah, animate that. Oh man, okay. All right. Well, we did that. Let's see. I'm gonna close Photoshop or at least hide oh, yeah, it. Oh, don't you have to unplug the. I know. Unplug. Okay, hold on. So we've got the this here. <laughs> hold on one second, folks. We're still here. We're. Um, maybe I'll read a little bit more about hands. Chris has um, refused to upgrade the studio, which we could desperately need a little really bit could of. Use it. Well, my surgery, my reconstructive facial surgery, is going to dampen that. Huh? So we're going to throw that into there. A fair amount of money. This is our. It's the extra hard drive, is what we call it. There's all some random okay, weird stuff. Okay, a few on other there. vertebrates, such as the koala, which has two opposable thumbs on each hand, and fingerprints remarkably similar to human fingertips, are often described as either having hands or paws on their front limbs. Hmm. That's interesting. Koala. Well, we, I guess we evolved from koalas. I'm going to quit Photoshop because it's going to be lagging out here. We're not going to save it. We don't really. I mean, we got the image that we need. We got the images, as you'd say, as that, that we need. So let's just see what we've got. Um, it's interesting about the koalas because I like those little bamboo shoots you can get when you get the. Uh, what the heck? Why is it all timed out? I don't know if you can see it, but I got a pinwheel. That's oh, gone. We're back. Okay. We're back. I'm getting already a little frustrated. Um, I like to show off my chops when things don't work. It's just, it's. Kind oh, of since we're doing a hand up, so one more thing to remember is. Um, there we go. Everyone has All a right. handedness. So media. there is really no such thing as ambidextrous. Well, that's I'm, not true, actually. I'm my, left handed. My, my, my brother, my younger brother can draw seriously with both hands. Have you seen his drawings? Okay, well, that's. They're, they're actually pretty amazing. Um, the human hand has 27 bones. So, as you remember, we named it one 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 and one 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 all right, so now we're really cooking. I know it's taking a while. We've got some weird delays, and we're just feeling, you know, dead time. But here we go. This is a always select. What the heck? Here, these are thirty frames. Thirty pixel. Uh, there we go. And then let's get this one. We're gonna select the whole item. If you guys have used, um, I think select called iMovie, it's very similar. Um, it's kind of like that. Okay, we let me just go ahead. And, and so I have a little bit heck? of koala fur left. All right, we're gonna pull that one down. This is really messy. Let's see if we can get this on top. What the heck. All right, here we go. Uh, and we're running out of time. I'm getting nervous again, so we're gonna do. We're gonna do crop this one. We're gonna crop it down. We don't need the whole image. We just need the hand. So you'll see now the the dog behind the hand. We're gonna crop it down really just to around the edges because you don't want it to look too uh, janky. Janky, right? That's a good term. Uh, but we're gonna do transform. Let's make it a little bit. Mm, smaller. Whoops. That's the opposite of smaller. No, we. Wow. What whoa, the? Okay. Whoa, whoa, whoa. So there we go. So we got it in the corner. That's it's coming out. Pretty good. Um, it's pretty. Ratio. It's pretty good. It's a small dog. So now what we're gonna do is we're gonna keyframe over here to have the hand actually pet the dog. I don't know if you saw that coming, but I thought it'd be pretty cool because it's, we all like to pet our dogs. Um, and so what we're gonna do is. Darn, I think okay. you named it hand pet, so they probably had some idea. Yeah. Yeah. That's, that's true. Okay, so what we do, we put it in the corner. We're going to go ahead and add a keyframe. Click. Hand looks dead. And then we're going to bring it over here. And we're going to go ahead and... The corpse hand. Bring it over. A, oops. Okay, wait. Hold on. We're going to bring it over. And... Okay. Oh, wow. Well, that's going to be a problem. But that's okay. We'll just go with it. Yeah. I'll bring it back. Oh, great. Oh, great. There we go. All right. Whoa. So now bring it down, and then we're gonna go ahead and come over here and Get have creative him with pet it, it. So there, he pets it. Oh yeah. So there. So now we've got the full motion. Let's go ahead and watch this in, in effect. So here comes the hand. Oh. Wow. Aww. That's awesome. Whoa. And he pets the dog. Oh, that's awesome. Kind of touched its eyeball. <laughs> and then that's it. So All right. that's pretty awesome, actually. So let's watch that one more time. Yeah, let's watch one more time. And animate this. The dog disappears a little bit, which is kind of weird. 
Yeah, no, it's fine though. But you still get the motion down, and that's what we're going for here in the animation. So All that's, right, folks, that's so our episode. Our hand intensive episode. We showed you how to create a realistic um, corpse hand that pets a playful dog. Thanks for watching, everybody. Wake on Texas. Texas.